whoa, whoa, whoa. I'll have to get all this extra pond water. Ooh. Relax, relax. Crazy. You don't like me? Why don't you like me? It looks so weird. Oh my god. Let's catch him up. Woo! With catch him up fishing with Zach Ketchum. Look at this fish. Oh my god. Catch him up. All right, guys. So today is finally the day, guys. We're going to replace our lost arowana. Look at everybody looking down at me. Especially the peacock. That thing is vicious. The red tail's over here, right by my feet. Everyone is looking great. I've been scrubbing this thing like crazy, but dude, this pond just wants to stay dirty. Look at that. Every day, just yesterday, I scrubbed this as hard as I could, but you know, it's getting tough. Guys, as you guys know, these guys eat out of my hand even while I'm standing inside the water. Come here, peacock. Come here. Hey, buddy. Want to eat? I don't have any food for you. I'm sorry. I love you. Don't hate me. Don't bite me. Don't bite me. Anybody want to bite me? Red tail? No? You want some? Wanna pretend like a half full? Hi, baby. Oh, your baby. Look at this beast. Huh? Want some? <laughs> so, what I'm doing right now, check out what I have in my hand. Look at this. I have four replacement screws that are a little bit thicker, guys, than the screws that are for my exits uh, to get all this extra pond water. Ooh. Relax, relax. To get all this extra pond water going back into the lake right over here through my outflow system. So I'm just gonna quickly and easily replace these little screws. As you can see, they're really shallow screws. Really, really small things. And I'm gonna replace them with a little bit fatter, a little bit thicker of a screw. It's gonna make this a little bit more secure so the arowana will have a lesser chance of hopping out. I'm just screwing in the heavier screws. It's nice. While this one is still secure, that's gonna be nice and tight. I'm gonna do the same thing with these two. Then I'm actually gonna drill a hole right here so these, all this stuff that's getting clogged in here will just flow right out, but the hole won't be so big that the fish will just escape out of here because arowanas and the pleco, some of these fish are just, just small enough that they would fit if this was completely hollowed out. Maybe a little like inch inside the middle mm -hmm. so that it has a little bit more room for that water to just flow right out and back into the lake. I just have all these fish that you can see right over here, <laughs> just giants everywhere. I don't want them to have like no water while I did this. I don't want, want to stress them out by taking every single one of those fish out and putting them back in because they're so just so large. Look, where am I going to put that? Look at that. Half of those fish are like bigger than you guys at home. <laughs> Seriously though guys, so what I'm going to do is cut a little tiny hole right here. Now that I put the new screws in there, I have the old screws right here in my little kangaroo pouch. <laughs> this is all rubber, so hopefully if I did drop this in here with slippery hands or something, I would survive. Wish me luck ladies and gentlemen. Okay, great. So that fell in there, I can grab it. It's a little hot right now, but I'm gonna grab it with my pliers. Got it. Got it, perfect guys. So, check this out. This little tiny difference, that little tiny difference guys, it's about an inch by an inch, is gonna make such a huge difference with that water escaping back into the lake. It's still metal and still very, very solid, so we're good to go on that. My babies, are you ready? Come here, Peacock. Here, you want some? I know you want some food. I know you made me something good. <laughs> but anyway, guys, handy dandy pliers strapped up. Come on. Got it. Come on. Got it, baby. Yes, perfect. So, obviously, a small fish can get out of that just fine, but our larger fish absolutely will not be able to. And it's just small enough that if a big leaf or something could get clogged in there, it won't. It's, it's perfect size. <laughs> look at all these guys stacked up. Look at them. Look at them all looking at me. <laughs> so, these guys will one by one eat out of my hand if I had any food. Don't have any food right now. They're all a little bit pissed that I'm in here, but they do like when I eat. But when I don't feed them, they get extra pissed. So, right now, we're going to go to our friend Predatory Fins, Rodrigo. They have a giant fish for me. I'm so stoked. I'm so excited. It was definitely worth doing a little project over there, getting ready for this big fish so we don't have any more mishaps. Eat up. Aww. Eat up, my children. Eat up. I know. I know. I love you too. No, I love the little Oscar, guys. That Oscar has been like the friendliest thing of all time. <laughs> Excuse me, everyone. Excuse me, everyone. Hi, 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 hi. How you doing? You're a good boy. Guys, I think you know where we're at, guys. Predatory fish. We're all the. <laughs> where all the giants are, and it will just rip you in half. 
Every time they do that, it spooks the hell out of me. Check out, check out the logo. Predatory Fins, guys. They also have a YouTube channel. I'm gonna cut. <laughs> Their YouTube channel is called Predatory Fins. My good friend Rodrigo, he's over there helping someone out, but we're gonna go talk to him in just a minute. No, you be a good fish. No, I, I'm scared, let's walk around. <laughs> My child, don't run from me. Oh, hello, hello. Guys, I want you to see this thing though. Don't run from me, don't run from me. Look at this, a short body guard. It looks so weird. Guys, please, have you ever seen anything like this in your life? What on earth? Mr. Turtle, I, we, we have, do we have to go through this again? Hello. Hello, my child. Hello. Oh, 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 oh. Go away. Whoa. Whoa. Ah! My child, I see you retain new friends and the demon of the sea. Hello, my child. What on earth are you? That's a, I think this is called a giraffe catfish. Look at the size of this catfish. Look at him. Look at the size of this thing. This is at least four feet long. This is a true alpha red tail catfish, guys. You guys should show up here on the monster fish pass. We're gonna have a huge get together. So all you guys can come over here, feed the monsters in this tank, say hi to me, Paul Caparo, Monster, Mike Raw, Fishing Joey, Slam, Wild Water, Farley. The whole squad's gonna be here, including Rodrigo, Predatory Fins himself. July 21st, Predatory Fins also has the link on their YouTube channel. It's gonna be at Monster Fish Pass, so you guys can sign up for your tickets as well. Hello, Mr. Parkour, hello. <laughs> Mr. Nuggets, hello, it's nice to see you. What are you doing? Come up to the surface. Ah! Why don't you want to come to the surface, huh? You don't like me? Why don't you like me? Why don't you, what are you doing? <laughs> Fine, whatever. Even the Placos are weird here. Excuse me, Mr. Tarpon, I'm trying to film a Placo. Let's see if I can be a little bit more careful, especially with you. Do not jump out. Where are you? I want to show you your friends, though. Oh my goodness, everyone's just sneaking up on me. Guys, what we're doing right here is I'm trying to get an albino arowana, not these two. These guys are regular silver arowanas. Obviously, that's my Paku down there. That's actually Troy's Paku. Troy Landry caught that on Swampy. Oh, Swamp People, I gotta be careful. I don't want my phone to be stolen by you, buddy. Look at that, I can barely, it's a balloon. It's a, it's a short body. Oh, rip saw, that's really cool too. That is a giant. Guys, let me know in the comments below if I should get another sturgeon, guys. No raccoons. I took care of all those things thanks to my stern talking. But yeah, these guys are all albino. Or actually, these guys, I think they're like platinum. Wow. What? What's going on with that thing, guys? He's got a lot of deformed, weird-looking fish here, predatory fins. Stuff is just... That's just weird. I bet none of you can name all three species of fish in this tank. One two and three guys i bet you can't name all three species i bet oh my god two three four bet you guys can't tell what kind of hybrid the catfish this is bet Bah, wake up, boy. We got a show to do. We're gonna bring this to something you guys have 100% never seen before. Check it out. Look at the colors on these two gar. That's crazy. I know you guys miss beautiful platinum gar, but this is something I've never seen before. This is a hybrid. I think it's of a Florida and maybe an alligator. I'm not sure, but it's definitely a hybrid of some kind that I've never seen. Look at the orange on this thing. Crazy. So I'm gonna feed this guy with the tongues. Uh oh. I sent the rhino. <laughs> Oh, no, no. <laughs> guys, this is Rodrigo. This is the owner of Predatory Fins, the host of Monster Fish Bash. July 21st, guys, Monster Fish Bash. I'm going to be there. He's going to be there. Paul Caparo, Monster Mike, Raw Fishing, Joey Slam, Wild Water Park, Chandler. They don't care if they're going to be here. Blake. Gonna be here. Kelly is going to be here. <laughs> Welcome to Negagra Falls, guys. When that <laughs> thing sweats, it goes all the way down and it fills up the tanks. <laughs> all right. Making sure that those fish don't get out. Look at that. Pure. Caveman ingenuity right there. <laughs> yeah, that, look at that. You want some? Oh, yeah. You want some? Here we go. Come on, let's do it. Oh, who's going to get it first? Come on, let's see. All right. All right. Check it out. Uh oh, dropped oh, it. No. Oh, my gosh, I dropped it. Oh, no. Snap it. Oh, that was crushing. All right, bro, if you want to be like that, you're really cool. You're worth a lot of money, that's for sure. But I do have someone who's going to eat this. <laughs> All right, cool. So now we're getting. Oh my God! Look how big that one is. I didn't even see that. Look at this thing. Oh, oh. Okay, I'll feed you first. Oh my <laughs> God! He got pissed. Sometimes you gotta do what the man's gotta do. Come on. Oh my <laughs> God! That is always gonna be scary. Look how big. Come here, look at that. Catch it, catch it, catch it. Get it. What are you doing? Oh, well. oh who's gonna get it? Oh. Look at that. Oh, you're too fast. 
Spooky. <laughs> They're giants here. But Predatory Fins is just really crazy. It's a really awesome place. Monster Fish Bash. If you guys came here last year, there's a whole bunch of new stuff to do. There's a whole bunch of new things to see. If you guys didn't come here last year, show up this year. We'll all be here. It's going to be a lot more organized. Guys, I see our Arowanas, but I saw this out of the corner of my eye. Check this out. Get really close. Oh my god! Are these paddlefish? Let's, let's see if they come up. Come on! Oh my god! Oh my goodness gracious! It's hard to get a good glance of them because the side is like a little bit blurry, guys. But they're really, really cool and interesting. I wish I had one in a tank. These things get so big. They get to be like as big as the Arapaimas nearly, guys. See, they're all cold water fish, so I can't take anyone home. Oh my goodness, so big, so cool, man. I think these are discuses, guys. Check this out. Ready for your fish, bro? No. no. <laughs> Where is it? Where is that? <laughs> oh my god. Guys, check this out. My god. The colors. I want an albino. Is that a platinum one? Yeah, it's an albino platinum. Oh my goodness. Well, there's one right behind you. Oh. Hello. Wait, wait, wait. I think I found my love. Hello. Hello, my child. He's missing a whisker. Hello. Yes, I feel some type of way to this one. Rodrigo, I would take the gold Al Brown though. I like Al Brown. Like he, he looks he looks like he's a little mixed like me. Let's put water in your thing over there. Okay, cool. How are we gonna do that? I got a bucket. Lisa. What? Lisa, what you got going on? That's my girl, give me some skiing. When do you guys you have so many new innovations? Look at this. That's straight from that's straight from the fresh water. All the way over there. What? What the these guys are where it's at. They have everything to get. <laughs> Okay, you're gonna pass for me. He looks great. That is gorgeous. Let's go ahead and have the transfer. Okay, cool. That way. Guys, we're just gonna do this as fast as we can. As you guys know, Arowanas are jumpers. Oh, Arowanas are jumpers. We're just gonna get him right in here. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Look at the colors. Oh my god. Don't jump on me. Look at the colors of that thing. What we're gonna do, we're gonna put a little bit more water on that. Then we're gonna go ahead and throw our super pump to make sure that this guy makes it home safe. This giant was caught actually and given a Rodrigo, guys. Oh my. This place is crazy. I like how you say my name, bro. What? Rodrigo. 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 Predatory fins, guys. This is where we're gonna have the monster fish bash. It's gonna be cleaned up, organized. Then we're gonna have a huge area for you guys to play around in, hang out with us. We're gonna have individual booths, guys. So there won't be such a long line to just talk to us. It'll be like more of a one-on-one -on -one interaction with each individual YouTuber, guys, including the neck of all necks. There's no drop by here. No drop by. That thing is a solid 22. Probably right on the money with that guest, bro. That is absolutely tremendously gorgeous. What we're gonna do, put our pump on them, take them home. By the way, we have smaller ones for sale. Oh, oh yeah. You're taking the biggest one. You have a small one. Everything here is for sale, guys. Absolutely everything that you guys saw in today's video is for sale and more. So check out Predatory Fins YouTube channel. Check out their website. They have everything you could ever want as fish related, like ever. Are you gonna be able to carry this, bro? Or you I, I honestly think that Kelly will be a little bit helpful, but I mean, if you want to just balance this on your neck, I can put it on your right neck. You know. This is our arowana, just a giant, beautiful beast. We're gonna go ahead and put them in the pond. If you get really close, to check out those little, uh, I forgot tendrils on them. I forgot, I forgot what those things are called. If you know what that thing is called, let me know in the comments below. Watch how quickly they heal inside this constant flowing pond, guys. Don't bite me. <laughs> we have a little bit more work to do with some of this. I'm gonna just put it around, make sure that these little holes right over here are gonna clogged up, that this guy just has no chance of jumping out, guys. This is finally working perfectly. All that water is going in there. It's not getting clogged at all, no matter what flowers and leaves get inside this pond. I'm gonna go ahead and put on my glasses. Just so this guy doesn't jump up, splash me in the eye, then I drop him, I don't know. I'm just freaking out, because it's such a gorgeous fish, guys. Check this thing out. All right, come on. Just gonna try to take my time. Come on, buddy. Come back this way. Don't wanna mess up his slime coat too much. Oh my God. Okay, come on, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. All right, one more time. One, two, and three. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Whoa. That was not the best way to do this, guys. <laughs> yeah, I was expecting. Hey, buddy. You okay? Look, there's nothing wrong with a little jumper. That guy jumps about that high anyway. <laughs> He's going to be just fine. But make sure you don't do that at home. I just wanted to show you guys a really, really pretty picture of that guy. But he was a little bit of a wiggler. So... <laughs> 
Oh my gosh, he looks great though. Check that thing he out. Does. That thing is just absolutely insanely gorgeous there. He's plenty big enough. He is just about as big as the last arowana that was in here, guys. Hopefully he does not jump out. Find a way to get out. I don't think there's going to be a way for him to jump out now. Guys, he's doing absolutely fine. He's not go slowing down at all. He looks super Hello. happy. And soon he's going to be eating lizards and all sorts of things, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode. It's uh, aside from that huge giant belly flop from that be beautiful arowana. It's coming together pretty nicely, but... There are a couple monsters that we need. Stay tuned for the next episode and catch them all. Catch them all! Woo! Catch them all! <laughs>